that settles the nerves for the extras. Here's uh, <laughs> Garrett to Fletcher. <laughs> Lovely pick-up shot, that one. He's clipped that one through uh, forward of square, and that'll be four runs. And here's uh, Garrett. I think it was a, an element of sympathy, maybe, as this is guided through uh, Gully by Schardendorf. That's a nice shot, and that'll be four runs. And uh, wide of deep third. Uh, celebrating this morning, winning the second 11 championship this season. And uh, Schardendorf has been a big part of that team. Celebrates by cutting this away for four more. A good delivery, but yeah, didn't uh, look out. Yeah, the stumps, they went up together. Next one is uh, driven. I was going to say into the offside, but it's through the offside because there isn't an offside um, of fielders. There isn't a ring. and Who knows? Is uh, oh, bowled in. Is a lead by Luke Fletcher. It's nipped back from George Garrett. That ends an entertaining innings from uh, Luke Fletcher of 22 from 37 balls. To get to the top, you've got to stick with it. But I think the system is uh, is slightly flawed. Here's Gilchrist. And he's wrapping Lord on his back pad and he's given him. Yeah, it turned him round. Good delivery and reward for Gilchrist, who's been excellent at times. A little expensive, but he's bowled wicket-taking deliveries. As Gilchrist bowls. That's, oh, it's a beauty. He's gone. Absolute perler from Nathan Gilchrist, who bowls these wicket-taking deliveries. So Jordan bowls to uh, Sean Dorf. He has launched that one. It's up in the air. Will Beldrummer get underneath that? That's a very fine catch on the run by Daniel Beldrummond. Sean Dorf back over the bowler's head, high and straight over the stumps. Heart wheeling across the other uh, turf here at uh, Canterbury. And one for Garrett and one for Jordan at the end for Kent as well. Lovely shot from a Ben Compton into the offside as Kent start. Upright. Oh, plays across his front pad and goes. Did that keep a little bit low? It looked like an indifferent looked, sort of shot. I thought it looked high. What coverage you get, really. As uh, Duffy is in, and Bill Trump is driving attractively. He's going to get a boundary. His first uh, runs of the day, and he gets them in an attractive fashion, driving through mid off. Fletcher starts a new over, and this one's hit in the air, but straight down the ground. Here's. Uh, Duffy and this one is mm. no need to run for that one middle and leg half volley just a little bit guilty maybe of pushing that one this is uh, drilled through the offside Duffy does pitch it up comes into Meillet has whipped this one out towards Rob Lord and straight down his throat didn't have to move a muscle and Meillet has just helped it out onto the leg side catching practice for Rob Lord and Fletcher's got two on his birthday 34 for two uh, here's Fletcher then to leaning shot. straight back us. there's a good shot check back past the bowler uh, Fletcher falls trying to uh, has 13 as Kent reply to Nottinghamshire's 433. Just bear with me, that's four more off the bat of Bell Drummond. Kent 46 for two then, and commentary continuing via the BBC Sport website. On this occasion, as Duffy to Bell Drummond, nicely mm. guided through square. Again, no backlift from Daniel Bell Drummond. Fletcher passed on by Middlebrook, wearing a coat. And this is just angled nicely by leaning. It's gone quickly down to third man for four. Like so many sides, not. This is uh, played nicely down the ground, and that'll go for four. Nice connection there. It's pitched up by Fletcher and Daniel Bell Drummond. Waiting for Linda James to come down from the Nackerton Road end. Ooh, and get something out of the way. Does he? No, he doesn't. He's dropped his bat too late. He's got an edge or maybe even a glove himself to that. Through to the wicket keeper, and Daniel Bell Drummond going shortly after lunch here. So Lord Bowles, oh, the edge that he's followed it Denley, and we'll keep a Schadenfreude uh, dives in front of his first slip, and uh, takes him. I don't know if that's broken the concentration, but it's got rid of Joe Denley. The ball seeming away from him. It could be a good thing. So Lord Bowles too, Jump. leaning on the up through the offside. It's a good shot indeed, and that will be three, I think, as far as oh, it is four. Is that a stop on the rope? I thought that was four. I thought it was. Cricketing wealth would be a good thing as well. Lord to leading, hits him on the body. Has it caught the glove? It has. He goes. And he was taking evasive action from a vicious short ball from uh, Lord there. Got up at him. Loyalty to their particular clubs, which I guess is the way of the world. As Finch drives, he's going to get four through the gap. Bit of width on offer from James. Wasn't a bad delivery. It was kind of up there and teasing. Oh, Lordy, was the message when he got his last wicket. Is He's been turned away beautifully uh, by Joey Everson. Just... Turned Still his on. wrists and timed it. 
Comes in with a slip and a short leg oh, and he's got a first wicked ball. first ball. Oh my word, extraordinary stuff as Harry Finch just chips it up to short leg and that's a dramatic start and for Han Ahmed. Sunshine now, always oh, pulled that away with some venom as Joey Everson. Stylish looking short and that is six runs, the first six of the innings. Oh, he's, he's, he's saying cricket's passing him by. Yeah, he's, 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 seen it. he's a... Ooh, goes forward to that and he gets the LBW shout as well. Uh, finger has gone up at the far end. Still standing there, Akeem Jordy. He's can't not happy. That. He's all effort. He shapes it a bit. That'll be uh, at least two for Everson. Yep. That'll be his 50. That's Joey Everson's 50. Played really nicely. We Do like that job. sort of stuff. We like that. Set for an army. Bowls and again. It's popped down. Oh, what a catch. Oh, that's Freddie McCann with a super catch. And Parkinson turns, tucks his bat under his arm and he's off. He knows it was cleanly taken. As uh, Duffy comes in again and he's, oh, he's absolutely cleaned him up with a beauty. So Gilchrist who uh, knocked out the stumps when he was bowling. Four byes, but apart from that, a, a brilliant effort. Here's Everson now. He's gone big. He's gone massive. Ooh. My car's down there, Joey. Just go steady. <laughs> it's a big six down the ground over the um, advertising boards at the far end. It's very pleasant now. As Everson hits this up into the air onto the leg uh, offside, and he's going to be caught. And is Slater underneath it takes the catch. Farn Ahmed gets his fourth wicket, and that will be T. Kenter all out for 200. 25. Joey Everson, last man out for 76. So Duffy is uh, in once more. Compton is going to get four for this. Not where he intended it. He was just covering up defensively. Thick edge. No risk. So Lord Bowles to Mie. That's a lovely shot through the offside. That's a standard deliver. No foot movement whatsoever. A flash of the bat. And it is thundered through cover. Three slips in behind to Andy Mie. He goes for this one and carts that into the onside, but that's along the ground. And that will be four runs. That's disappeared really quickly again. As you say, he's on that so quickly. It's a solid bit of cricket. And uh, cover drive actually just opened the face slightly there to Andy Mie. He's guided that forward a square on the offside. That's four more runs. That's very differently left handed, of course, as he's uh, punching and lifting. So a bit short and wide from Duffy. Compton as his second. That is a beautiful looking cover drive. That is straight out of the Ian Bell textbook. Foot to the pitch. Didn't try and over hit. Yeah, it was unfortunate. 12 points seems harsh as he pulls this one, Mayaya, and that is what he is all about. Back of a length, just a six inches or so outside off stump. A lot of batters be pushing that into it. So Lord is in again. He's wide this time, and he's going to get four more here. He didn't time that one as well. But it uh, wasn't Lord's best delivery. Just open the face, a bit low on the bat from the far end. Short and pulling, and that is what he does. And you can't drop it back of a length to Tawanda Miyeye. He's hit that for six over ooh, a wide long on stroke straightish mid wicket. Like that. Well, crashed it through extra cover. It was catchable height, but it uh, pierced the gap. There was no danger. And uh, follows the pull for six over mid wicket. With James Bowles to uh, Compton drives a foolish one. It's gone past Hasiba Mead, and that'll be four runs. I thought for a moment he hadn't quite, and certainly, and it's driven by me. I thought it was going to hit the stumps at the far end. Hasiba Mead has to give up the chase on that one on the practice strips, and that goes straight down the ground on drive four, four runs. Mie goes to 49 from 48 now, and uh. Making things a bit too interesting for uh, Nottinghamshire. And that is the 50 from Tawanda Mayeye. And uh, it takes a single into the onside, a low pull away. Deft it was too. 50 from 49 balls. With him out, then I'll have to go and update the listeners to the Robin Hood County. And that's short from uh, Farhan Ahmed. Doesn't even look to see where it's gone himself. He knew it was short and he knew that Mayeye had uh, completely... Mr. Bowl beats Compton outside his off stump. There's an ooh. From uh, slips, well, from all the fielders, I think. Takes his cap as uh, the off spinner. I mean, 16. Goodness me. 85 for none, playing a massive part in this game. Yeah, he uh, is.